Okay, my name is Elijah Nkosi. I'm staying in Pishekas. The reason why I'm here, actually I'm having a business. I'm opening a business, which is my own company. It's an insurance company. Uh, I'm here because I need the, the guidance. I need the, uh, the mind of God, actually. I need, uh, 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 I need a direction from our parents to say, because this kind of business, there's always challenges along the way. That's why I'm here. Actually, I'm so excited. I'm looking forward because the only thing that he mentioned, he told me to have confidence because he can see I've got all the necessary experience, knowledge and everything. But one thing that I must do, I must just be confident and then I must believe God more and more so God will prosper me. I, I was so excited, I was so happy because I was a little bit worried when I came here earlier on. Actually for the past three weeks I was so stressed because I was busy recruiting people and going up and down doing interviews and everything. And now the, 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 the time has come where I had to get the premises and everything and start the business. So, but so far I'm happy, I'm looking forward, and I know I'll never go wrong because I was here. Uh, I don't have much to say, but one thing I'll say, I'll say they must believe God more and more, and then they must come here at Charis Missionary Church, because, you know, Charis Missionary Church is one church that you will never regret once you enter this building. You'll get a lot, you'll get guidance, you'll get, you know, they will even pray for you to say, to, to become successful. And then I believe most of the people outside they are struggling. The only way is to come here and serve God and then they will prosper. Uh, okay, hi, my name is Lidi Lemasekwa. I'm from, I live in Soweto, but I'm from Pulukwan. Yeah, um, I came here because uh, I didn't, I dropped out of school. So, yeah, that's why I came here. And then I was not doing much in my life. So, but then the pastor, Mamrudi, prayed for me today. And she told me that uh, I will, I'm going to continue and I'm going to finish with my studies. She told me that it was a spiritual attack of my studies. And then it's going to it's gonna go away. Yeah. Yeah, I, 
I think I just I just know that the devil is after me, but then I'm I'm happy because uh, there will be an improvement. Yeah, in my yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it was kind of exciting because she was she was speaking about my life. Yeah, yeah. I feel happy. I feel happy because I know and I believe that all will be well. Yeah. I can say that don't give up on God, that uh, whatever, whatever happens, God knows, yeah, and then he's, he's there and he'll help us in whatever we go through. Yeah. <laughs> okay, my name is Joy Siaka from Soweto. Okay, uh, the problem that made me come here, basically I actually came here because of my sister. I came here some other time ago when I, I had a challenge of a headache, but uh, uh, Muruti and then Lima Muruti, they prayed for me, I was delivered. And then today I actually brought two of my family members, of which my sister was you know, not okay, but I needed deliverance for myself as well. Yes, she actually asked me about uh, the business of which it's still in a, a idea stage. Yes, and I confirmed that. And then she told me about my health, that uh, whatever attack that my sister had was actually affecting me even health-wise, of which was the truth, you know. Yeah, so whatever that she actually, you know, told me happened to be, yes. delivered <laughs> delivered the moment she said you're free I was able to you know st stand up and yeah I believe that I'm walking into open doors yes career wise business wise you know in every angle of my life yes
Okay, thank you. Thank you.